This is how one of the longest standing battles of the Syrian war is coming to an end. The buses you can see behind me are evacuating over 700 militants along with over 4,000 civilians who were trapped by the fighting inside the city of Daraya, south of the Syrian capital Damascus. Daraya is considered uh, as one of the most important strongholds for rebels in the countryside of Damascus ever since they took control of it back in August 2012. And since then, the Syrian army uh, was in the middle of a wide-scale military operation to regain control of this strategic Damascus suburb that is located less than eight kilometers from the city center of Damascus and less than two kilometers from the outskirts of Damascus. This deal that uh, is seen by many as a substantial gain for the Syrian army as it means that the army will regain control of this Damascus suburb and it will make it much more difficult for rebels to even think about uh, moving on the Syrian capital Damascus and trying to take control of the Syrian capital. Uh, the rebels who will be evacuated from Daraya today will be given safe passage to the northwestern province of Idlib where they will be joining other rebel factions, mainly radical rebel factions and Al-Qaeda affiliates in Syria, while the civil Civilians will be taken to shelter centers located in the vicinity of the Syrian capital Damascus. Uh, by this, the Syrian army would be ending one of the longest and most tragic chapters of the Syrian war. The destruction, the toll of the destruction you can see on every building behind me because of the four years of fighting that this city has witnessed. Many residents that CCTV has been speaking with say they hope to return to their city someday. Some of them has been forced out of the city in previous years because of the fighting and some of them are leaving now as part of this evacuation deal. Allah Ibrahim, CCTV, Damascus.